I hope this is in focus. I swear to God, if this isn't in focus, I will cry. Hey everyone, welcome to this week's vlog. Um, I don't know why I'm saying this week because they don't run on a weekly schedule anymore. All the days merge as one. Before I talk about what I did today, on Monday, Snap posted my video on their Facebook page. So if you haven't watched the full BTS edit, I'll leave a link in the description below because it's banging. And it was really good to have the guys just love it and call me the first lady of Snap. I'll take that. I'll take that as a compliment. <laughs> and lots of people shared it, lots of people liked it, and 42 are really happy with it as well. So for me, that was a massive success and I'm super happy with that edit. So yeah, we did it guys. I finally pulled through and actually edited the video and it's done and I feel so good about it. <sighs> so after spending a long time editing that video, a bunch of cached files have built up on my laptop so I spent this morning clearing out my laptop so that it would actually run because editing last week's vlog was a struggle because of how gutted my laptop was it's just like the fuck why have you got so many files hun clear me out so finally went through all the shit that's on my desk desktop because with my course I have to document everything I'm doing so that means screenshotting all my research, any video I watch, any frame that I think is interesting, screenshot it. Any change I make when I'm editing a Premiere file, screenshot it. Any tutorial I watch, any inspiration I get, screenshot it. So I have a lot of screenshots because a lot of my projects are video based or animation based. There's a lot of frames saved on my desktop that I haven't gone through yet. So I finally bundled them all into folders, threw it on my external hard drive in a folder called I'll deal with it later, pretty much. <sighs> but it did mean my laptop felt a lot better and I could actually edit last week's vlog. So I did a bit of that today, did some colour grading, added in the text files and sent it to export. So it should be done exporting now, so we can go now work on the thumbnail for that and upload that. Today is Friday and yesterday I went to my flat to go pick up lights and my camera because I want to take part in Peter McKinnon's weekly uh, photo challenge I guess. Uh, this week's theme is what is isolation to you and I kind of looked around and thought what could I take a photo of that would represent what isolation is to me and for me it's mostly working from home. Yeah, so basically I'm going to try and take a photo that represents that and I've got a cool idea of having it kind of staged in the middle of this room with me at my computer and the blinds shut off as if the world outside shut off from me. And some cool like blue moody lights, so let's see how it goes and what we end up with. <laughs> So this is like the initial setup right now. Um, I'm gonna set up the camera and see how it looks on camera, how wide the lens is and stuff like that. I'm hoping to edit it and make it look really blue and moody and kind of sad like, but right now it just looks pretty white, which is nice and clean. So hopefully that'll make it easy to edit. We'll see. Thank <laughs> you. 
finally picked up one of my mugs when I went home the other day and it makes me feel so much happier to drink from a proper mug rather than a floss like a boss mug. Sorry Hamish. So last night I continued editing the photo that I took yesterday. I actually did a lot more editing than what I showed because my laptop was not enjoying having a screen recording program run at the same time as me editing on Photoshop. Basically my laptop's a way to die soon and I'm kind of worried about that because I'm relying on it heavily, heavily for my degree this year. So <laughs> I might need to start doing a lot of backups, a lot of, a lot of backups. <laughs> I also sorted out all my projects last night for uni. I am doing a whopping 18, 18 projects. That's not in, like, that's including things I've started over the year and then I've dropped like Grey's Film Nights or Transition Extreme. Like these are like projects that I started doing and I started a sketchbook for and I did a little bit of research and I like did a proposal and then I dropped, but I'm still counting them. Like I've still done work for them. So I'm still gonna obviously submit that. I just need to now make it all digital and make it make sense and explain why I stopped these projects when I did. Ugh. So yeah, there's still a lot of uni work to do, but we're not doing that today. Instead, I'm going to edit the hard grind videos because I started on that last night. And um, it's been a while since I've been editing these this footage because obviously I've had other projects come up and and you know, take priority and hard grind is just an as and when I can do it sort of project. So now that I've got all this time and I feel like the guys would really appreciate some content to be posting on their social medias, I thought this would be the best time to start editing the backlog of footage that I have to do. Um, so hopefully we'll bash through that today and tomorrow and probably the next day. <laughs> Good morning everyone, today's Monday. I just checked my emails, I'm not working today, so I'm just finishing off rendering Nathan's video so that I can send it to him and get it approved before I start editing everyone else's videos. I'm really happy with how it turned out, I think it looks badass, super cool edit. So if he approves it, um, you can probably go find it on the Hard Grind Instagram page. Uh, I'm still deciding how I'm going to be posting these on my social media, so I might be experimenting with that this week. But for now, I'm going to end this week's vlog. I'm ending it on a Monday. Very stupid of me. I should have filmed my ending last night, but I just caught way too in the edit and then I was knackered. So I thought I'd just better leave it there. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys are all staying safe, staying indoors, you know, being careful, taking care of each other, all that stuff. And I will see you all next week. Bye guys.